So here we have this True Position cabinet hardware jig. Now this comes in a really nice case that has everything inside to install cabinet handles or knobs on your doors and drawers. There's a sticker, a warranty, and an instruction booklet. And then here's the actual jig. It comes put together right out of the box, which is why the box is so big. You also got a five millimeter drill bit, which is what you're gonna need to drill all the holes. And then this little case here with some feet for the back of your jig and then some magnets. It has a whole bunch of different sliders on it to help you perfectly line up all your different kinds of cabinet hardware. So like I said before, this jig is great for installing all different kinds of cabinet hardware. So let me go show you how to install this drawer pull here. First, you're gonna wanna make sure these sliders are spaced out correctly, and you could measure the distance between the holes here, or you could just set it on top and put some screws in from the back. As you can see, they're pretty well spaced out, and you can go ahead and center those up on the center here. Make sure to tighten them down, and then you can take the handle off. Go ahead and mark the center on the back of your drawer, and if you're putting it in the center for the height, figure out what that is also, and go ahead and set the top stopper to that. Now we're just gonna line up this notch here with the mark we made in the center, and then you can easily slide this side stopper over and lock it down. And now you can easily make a whole bunch of repeated holes on the same size drawers. Finally, here's the easiest step. Just take the drill bit they provided and drill the holes. And if you're putting a knob on this, you just use that center hole. Then it's all ready to put your handle on and screw in the screws. That was super easy, and now we got a perfectly centered handle. Now this jig can only line up handles for drawers that are 12 inches wide, but if you take this stopper off here, then you can just find the center line it up with that notch, and drill holes for as wide of a drawer as you want. A couple other things to mention, these magnets are used to block these holes here so you don't accidentally drill a hole where you don't want it. So if you're drilling handles, you'd block off the center, and if you're using knobs, you'd block off the two side ones. And then these feet here just screw into the back like this, and that's for if you have a shaker style drawer like this where the edges are raised, you can easily just adjust the legs on here and then set it on so it's perfectly flat. So anyway, this jig works great and it's super sturdy. It'll also save you a ton of time and frustration when you're setting up your cabinet hardware.